Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Shen Plays. I'm your host, Shenra, and this is episode two of our Aragon campaign in Europe Universalist 4. This is on the hard difficulty, which for some reason they don't have very hard this time. But hard will have to do. Oh my god. We're recruiting some more troops. We're gonna need them, because uh, this war is not going well. Man. If we can get it. Oh, we're gonna use all of our manpower, aren't we? Oh well. Cess Lavis. Oh god, and Portugal's got some noble rebel problems. Alright, we're keeping them blocked. That's great. There's enemies in my lands. What the shit? We are regrouping our we are regrouping our troops it just takes a long ass time and England's doing the same thing they're rebuilding their army we're actually winning this war somehow blockades I guess Okay, our troops are done. Everyone meet up in Barcelona, please. Or Girona, whatever. France is coming! France is coming! Run away! Yeah, they are definitely coming. Why are you retreating, Naples? You should help me here. Oh, now France is running away. They're like, nah. Oh no, here they come. 19,000 motherfuckers. This is not going well. Can we retreat? Down to Valencia. Probably not. Oh yeah, we can. Good. Let them waste their time down here. And in the meantime, we can regroup some of these lost troops. Get the fuck out of here, France. No one likes you, and you're ugly. And England will hopefully take this shit back in the meantime, but who knows. Genoa has insulted us for some reason. I don't know why. Scotland broke their alliance with Leinster. Hmm, okay. Those are the messages I'm not sure I really need, you know? So France has, what, 22? They have 31,000 guys roaming around my lands right now. That's a lot. Our manpower is gone. How's France's manpower? That's a real good question. It's gone as well, so they have no reinforcements available. That's great. Alright, let's go help out this uh, Portuguese invasion effort. Go help our vassal. Shit. Not a vassal, a uh, personal union dude. Oh, he's gonna get attacked. There we go. Yep. Okay. Let's get there. What day are you arriving? The 27th. Alright, let's wait until the 26th. Two, three, four, five, six, go. Live, Naples. Live, damn you. I will help. Yeah. 
Nice. They are shattered retreating to Dauphine. Great. And they were destroyed. Okay, that's one army down. Uh, can we get another army? It looks like they're grouping up into a death stack in Rusalon. So let's... Uh, no, let's go around this way. I know we're going to take attrition, but I just don't want to... Um, be too aggressive. Go this way, go this way. There you go. Go hide in the corner, regroup whatever manpower you can. We're not getting much manpower a year. That's going to be a problem. Shit, the war ended. England will cede Normandy and pay ducats. Okay, the war's over. It's fine. Go home. Stop funding the troops. Great. Uh, we didn't win the war, but we, do, we did keep some good allies. Uh, uh, why does Burgundy not like us? No, they do. It's just not much. Huh. Alright, well, whatever. Good enough. Maybe next time we can, uh, we can start the war against France and have England, Portugal, and Burgundy on our side. That'd be great. Uh, we have claims on Toulouse. Good. Good for us. Let's also put a claim in Languedoc. Because why not? Hey, we got a claim. That was our mission. Now what? Protect against Castile. Incorporate Navarra. Claim our rival's province Madrid. Claim Madrid. Uh, I don't think we can. I don't think it's even possible because that's their capital. Oh, no. Their capital's in Toledo. Ooh. Hold on. Madrid based 11. Toledo. Oh, yeah. Let's claim Madrid. Base 11 tax. I'll take it. Claim Madrid, sure. I thought that was the capital, but I guess not. It's Toledo. Leinster broke their alliance with Tyrone, okay. Munster broke their alliance with Tyrone, okay. Okay. Troops are almost home. So now we can heal up, we can regroup get our manpower back up. Everyone will be nice and happy. Uh, we should get some more shippy ships. What's our limit on ships? 30. We can have four more. All right, give me four more ships. I want... Barks. One, two, three, four. Oof. All right, how long until this tech? 600 power. These early techs are actually very expensive. I'm surprised. What's our first idea? Oh, we don't have any ideas. So we can pick whatever we want. Oh, that's great. Where's my main navy? Ah, over here. Looted has expired in Aragon. Province has been looted. When a temporary province modifier expires... Yeah, I guess that's fine. Alright, ships, come back. Oh, Genoa's getting claims on all my shit. Get the fuck out of here, Genoa. Spain is now hostile towards us. We have a rivalry. Cool. They don't like England either. So that's good for us. Uh, the only bad thing here is they are allied with my ally, Portugal. And I'm not sure which side Portugal would join on. If they join on Spain's side or Castile's side, we might be utterly fucked. Anyway, how long until we can um, inherit you? Oh, we have to marry him first. All right. 
an ex vassal. Uh, eight more years. All right, we'll have to wait eight years anyway. Great. Let's put the speed up again. Ah, oh, this is fantastic. Oh, there you go. Poland has formed a personal union with Lithuania. Lithuania will now be ruled by the king of Poland. So it did happen. It's happening. Wow, I'm surprised that actually happened. I don't think it's hard coded or anything, but it may be there maybe the event is hard coded. Like maybe they're forced to ask. Can we get any good advisors? I don't really want to throw a military in there, but diplomatic tech cost, that might be nice. We can certainly afford a, a cheap dude. Oh, he's not even a cheap dude, he's an expensive dude. We're still making money. God damn. The economy in Aragon is so good. So good. Oh yeah, let's convert the culture of Sardinia over here, because they're never going to be accepted. So that costs us 100 diplomatic points. Bye-bye, diplomatic points. And our barks are done. Great. Group them up. Meet in... Uh, Tunis, I guess. Cape Bon. The good cape. Okay. Group up, and you guys are going to patrol uh, Tunis. Go for it. Look at that, we have so many troops to replenish. That is just scary how depleted we got in that war, but oh well. Oh shit, what's this? Gas gun patriots. And England can't even put them down because they got their own problems. Shit. Poor England. Why are they not going over here to fight the Aw, oh, we embarrassed the court. Damn it. Stability, please. Why would you go and do such a dumb thing like that? We're never going to get our tech up if you embarrass the court again. What a jerk. Uh, how's Castile doing on armies? Mm, 24. That's pretty strong. Strong. Portugal's only got 4k? Yeah, their rebels are a real problem. Peasants' War. Yep. Those are nobles, dude. Ah, eh, whatever. Those are nobles. I can't believe they have Sweden and Norway in personal union. That's amazing. Chance of inheriting Sweden, negative 4%, because it's so big. It's so big. <laughs> And we have to wait 50 years before we have even have a 1% chance of Naples. But that's okay. I don't mind having Naples just chilling over there. They're like, yeah, it's cool. It's cool. Oh, man, our max manpower is 23,000. We only have 10% of that. Oof. Painful. Can we go kill these guys for England? Probably. Because we have an alliance, that means we can probably just walk up in there. No, we can't. We actually have to ask for access. Are you kidding me? Well, that kind of sucks. Here, stop improving relations. Let me get access and I'll kill your stupid rebels because you're a dum-dum. You can't figure it out. God, sometimes. Kill them. Attach a siege and go home. Lower maintenance. 
This is all because England doesn't have cores here, right? No, they do have cores. Well... I guess they were funded by Armagnac or France or something. Someone funded those troops, because they have a core there. How's the culture shift going? Culture shift is at 27%. Okay. So Sardinia, after a couple years, I guess... Yeah, three more years. We'll convert from Lombard into uh, Castilian, or what is it? Catalan. Let's go blockade them. That will help. And we can do our military attack. Great. Fantastic. We can now build armories. And every building costs a certain amount of money and points. This one uses military points because it's a military building. It uses 10 military points. Kind of expensive when you think about it, but still useful. Alright, hurry up at that damn siege. I'm taking attrition. We'll just attach a blockade and go home. I don't feel like taking too much attrition. Switzerland lost a war. What was that all about? Württemberg have accepted peace with Switzerland on the following terms. Württemberg will cede Constance to Switzerland. Really? Wow, go Switzerland. Ottomans move their capital to Constantinople. Aw, bye-bye Byzantium. Bye-bye Byzantium. <laughs> Are you going to rename it to Istanbul? Hey, we got a claim on Madrid. Great. You gonna rename it? You're gonna keep it Constantinople. There we go. We finished that mission. Now what? Take Madrid. Uh, protect against Castile. Wow, they have 28,000 dudes. I probably should. Man, look at Portugal. They have peasants and nobles all in rebellion. They're gonna get overthrown. We're gonna lose our royal marriage over there. God damn. Uh, go back to goody goody with this guy. Wait, what was that? Oh, royal marriage. There are subjects, blah, blah, blah. Novara needs a marriage, though. There you go. You guys need just relations improvement. Keep kissy kissy. Uh, yeah, we got a ways to go. That's fine. I want to keep England strong for now, because we need them against France. We just do. Who are you allied with Burgundy? Hungary, Britain, Aragon, and the Pope. Why well, you got a lot of alliances? Oh my god. They have two giant stacks of peasant rebels over here. That is just horrifying. Uh, protect against Castile. Do we want to do that? We need to have 28,000 troops. Yeah, we'll do it. I think I need to get rid of this douchebag. He's great, but he's expensive. Uh... Well, how much is he affecting diplomatic? Yeah, just do this guy. He's cheaper. Save money. The Pope took over Ancona. Good for you, Pope. Oh, the Pope likes us. Really? Yeah, the Pope's like the shit out of us. We're friendly towards each other. Or he's friendly towards me. Austria doesn't give a shit. Allied to rival. Okay, never mind. Are you a rival of Burgundy? Is that what's going on? Yes, you are. Do you have claims on Burgundy? Probably. No? Not sure why you're a rival, but whatever. Almost done with the siege here. England, you better thank me for this shit. Took a lot of time out of my day to make this happen. Oh god, poor Portugal. Oh, Spain's trying to kill them, kill them for them. Or Castile's trying to kill those um, rebels for him. Good luck. Fifty-six percent. Come on. Just give in. Uh, Grenada was annexed by Castile. Damn. That means they're going to build an even larger army now. 
I think we can turn off the new leader pop-ups. Yeah, turn these off. That's too many. Uh, don't need a pop-up and pause. Sure, give me an icon over here in this window. That's fine. Come on, 56%, just finish it. Jesus Christ. Hmm. Great, now come home. I'm actually gonna split you in half. And we need to get up to, there we go. Oh, we lost our ship over there. Wow. Huh. Uh, it was a transport. No, it was a galley. I'm an idiot. Uh, we do need more ships anyway. I'm just not going to... Oh, man. Oh, we even have an admiral that I'm not using. Derp. <laughs> I should have looked at what leaders were available. In any case, let's get uh, some more military. We're going to go over our limit just to meet this mission goal. What are we going to get when we finish that goal? Gain some tradition. Ah, whatever. Let's get some cheap units. Oh, unhappiness among the peasantry. Spend money to make them happy or gain prestige and lose stability. Now we'll spend the money. I don't want to lose stability. I hate losing stability. In fact, I'm going to pay to get stability up. Take that stability. Literally. Take that stability. So the big question is, would Portugal join us in a war against Castile? No, they would not. And England would not either. Because England's just fucking weak as shit right now. God, look at England. Cornish nationalists. Poor England. <laughs> Oh, our king died. Ooh, um, that's not good, because this guy sucks. Well, I'm not going to say admin power sucks. He's given us four admin points. Wow, look at that. Eight, four, three. Ooh. Yeah, take the discipline guy. I just want to make sure we get a decent amount of points. We're taking a small hit here because we have too many relations. Ooh, relations. But that'll be okay. When, what year is it? When 1455 rolls around. So five more years, we'll be able to annex these fools. That'd be great. Okay, armies are building. Do some more buildings. Great. How's the culture shift going? 64%. Alright. Well, things are progressing. Hopefully Castile doesn't, you know, go ape shit on us. Pass the Liquor Act. National tax goes up. Stability cost goes up. Mm, yes. I like tax. Someone annex someone. I wasn't even reading it. Almost back to full strength. Yeah. And then we're going to get all of our manpower up to tip top shape. Castile is sitting on 28,000. God, they are scary. What's Portugal's relations with Castile? I know they're allied, but how good of an ally are they, you know? Uh, improving relations with Castile and and Castile's improving relations with them. Damn it. I'm trying to make sure that if we go to war with each other, that Portugal will join on Castile's side. Well, hopefully that won't stay true. I would prefer to have Portugal on my side, even though they're weak right now. Even with They only have 3,000 troops. Even so... Oh yeah, we have... Uh, Rivalry with um, Morocco. I forgot about that. We should look at taking some of their shit. 
Because if we core some of this stuff down here, then we can start looking at maybe colonizing. That'd be fun. How much do we need for this first tech? We need 600. All right. Genoa is also allied with Castile. Ooh. Well, if they ever break their alliance, or if these guys ever break their alliance, that would be a good time to go to war. Georgia will see Emma ready to act coinly. Aw, poor Georgia. They just got eaten. Got to get our relations all the way up to 190. Oof. It looks like we're the first nation... Oh no, France got it up too. I was going to say, I thought we might be the first nation to get our military up, but France did as well. And Savoy has uh, diplomatic up. Cool. Ooh, Genoa's got military and diplomatic. Wow. Oh, we should get diplomatic soon enough. Syndicat Romentia. The nobility of the Energies Empire have begun to strictly enforce the rules that ties peasants to the land. Uh, allow peasants to form a syndicate regentia. What does this do? Local manpower goes down by 10%. Lose revolt risk. Lose prestige. Uh, but we gain goods produced. Or ignore it. Oh my god, look at that. Am I reading that right? 50 revolt? Do we want 50 troops to revolt? No, we don't. So, holy shit. Yeah, we'll accept that. I don't want 50 troops to revolt. My goodness. 50 troops to revolt. Oh, wow. All right, speed up again. Let's just plow through this. Genoa declared war on Savoy. Ooh, is Castile going to help? Looks like no. But they kept the alliance. Oh, they, did, they didn't call Castile in. Ah. We discovered the Canaries, which is owned by Castile. All right. Muscovy has collapsed. They could not even fight a proper... Oh my god, Muscovy's gone. Look at Twer. Huh. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh my goodness. Muscovy. <laughs> oh no. Well, I mean, it's not, it's not a bad thing. It's just, it's different. I'll give it that. It is different. Wow. And we changed the culture of Sardinia. Fantastic. They are now proper Catalan. Great, and then they produce copper for us. Good. I like copper. Ah, we are out of time. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed this episode today. Join me next time where we will incorporate Navarra and look at other options for going to war with Castile. Oh, they did join. Look at that. They did join Genoa's war. At war with Brittany, Scotland, Mantua, Ferrara, Modena, and the Pope. They're at war with the Pope. Wow. All right. See you next time, guys. Have a good one.